How's it going, everyone? Thank you for stopping by. <clears throat> they call me Kay, and it is a pleasure honor being with you here today. Um, so, a little heads up. Um, unfortunately, um, I actually, if you if you did notice, if you didn't notice, who knows by now, right? Um, I actually put, or I didn't put a, um, what is it, a video out. I actually missed a day in a video. And it's mostly a part three to our mercenaries let's play reason why there was no video to say <laughs> for the least part um <clears throat> is because in recording these other episodes apparently through after recording and everything it's actually reason why you do test before you start recording um that for some reason the microphone i mean it was it was it wasn't muted physically but it was muted in the application that I used to record on so all that footage that I got previously I did about a couple episodes um, all that progress I did um, I have it I do um, and I might actually throw in a couple clips here and there while I'm talking however they don't have commentary they're just game audio and that's it so I really contemplated it about it <laughs> And I sat there and I thought, well, shit, what am I going to do? And to be completely honest, there wasn't much that was missed anyways. There wasn't anything game-breaking. The only thing that was done was me rambling on and on and on and talking. But also also just flying around with a helicopter a little bit and kind of finding the low-end clubs. And also finishing some of the faction's missions to where I did... Um, like the queen of clubs and the king of clubs other than that i did not do the ace um i haven't done the jack of clubs yet which is actually where i was going to leave off now so that brings us to now <laughs> which is where we're at so i kind of just made the executive order that i would just um continue on with the series anyways um and this is actually kind of how how our deck card looks now i'm deeply saddened about it um, this is our faction right here. Um, I'm deeply saddened about it. Um, <laughs> North Korea, always hostile. Good to know. Um, deeply saddened about it and disappointed in myself. I feel bad and I apologize um, if it ruined the entire experience. I understand. Um, you can hate me all you want. So be it. Um, but I'm going to continue on. And I'm going to kind of just show you where we kind of left off. Um, so these are all the vehicles. I happen to get a few more. I happen to get the Chinese BJ 2020 Scout um, and the H3 delivery, which is basically the Hummer H3. Um, I also got a bunch of supplies. I don't know in particular what I left in in the second episode, but I know some newer ones like the vehicle repair. That's new sniper rifle, covert um, vehicle ammo, and I think that might be it. But then. Um, <clears throat> Those are what we got for supplies and airstrikes. We got a couple new ones. We got the gunship support and we got cluster bombs. So that's going to be that. Um, so I'm going to stop with everything as far as complaining. And um, I'm going to just jump right into it, right? Uh, so let's go in and see what the mafia wants. Now, I'm pretty sure I know what they want. Um, we're gonna have to do. Yeah, I know. Come on in. Let me give me my mo give me my money. All right. <laughs> so what we're gonna do is probably gonna have to go after the jacket clubs. All right. Not too bad. Oh, deliver crate to mafia warehouse. Okay. I know I'm not on good terms with you guys, and that's. Pretty much previous of what happened in the lost, we'll call it the lost episodes, right? Um, ooh, this has a minigun and missiles. See, this is the helicopter I want. Holy shit. This is the helicopter I want. <clears throat> but in the last episodes, the lost episodes, um, we kind of just, uh, we did contracts for other factions and then actually forgot who it was if it was the Chinese or the South Koreans but they had me go after the Russians and kill some Russians so that's why they're not too happy but um yeah looks like we have something here 
Oh yeah, get the crate, duh. We're gonna have to, whoa, 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 cowboy. We need to, oh, these are friendlies, okay. Chinese. Oh, this is cool, okay, cool. Winch up, sorry. I don't know if I have to like talk to the guy. Or is that like a bonus? I don't know. I'm just gonna take off of this crate before it goes haywire. And it just beats my ass in the sky and then I just crash drama dramatically. <laughs> but yeah. How's it going everyone? Um, thank you guys actually for uh, commenting on the last episode. Having some conversation with me. I really appreciate it. I actually wanna take this time. Well, kinda already at the objective now. But I will take some time and address some comments that uh, we had talked about or that we conversated about. If this is it, I'm going to be really disappointed. Okay, let go. Objective complete. Call the winch. 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 Return copter to the mafia garage. Okay. We'll do that. Is that it? Do I get the helicopter now? I... <laughs> It's actually kind of the reason why I wanted to do the Russian Mafia is because I really want this helicopter. Let's see here. Exit. Wow. Simple. So, yeah. Like I said, I wanted to take this time out and, um... $30,000 for that? Okay. North Korea Sugri Scout Delivery. So, that's good. We can actually get a little Scout uh, Korean, North Korean truck that we can disguise ourselves into that if we need to go and disguise and sneak into somewhere so that's good so yeah i'm gonna stand on this porch um <clears throat> roland in the comment section below from the last video he added that you can find a free uh 60 helicopter near the allied hq enter it and cancel the challenge and you can use this every time it's in the west of the small bridge in the river next to the hq so in the lost vids, I went out and I actually followed his instructions and I stumbled across it. I'll actually put a little video overlay here, um, B-roll, however you want to say. And it is true. It is the thing. And um, that is awesome. That really, it was really cool because I didn't know that you could just enter those challenges and then that'd be that. Can I actually get down from here? So, um... Yeah, I can. So I really appreciate that. Thank you, Roland, for that tip. Um, greatly appreciated. I also had a, another comment um, with a John. Co well, it wasn't from John Cooper himself. It was actually from someone else. But conversation just kind of led into each other. Um, <clears throat> it went off by um, basically saying that this game, Mercenaries, is one that is beloved and someone loved it. And John Cooper actually said the same, honestly. And then I responded with one of the, my top favorites in the back of the day. Also, John said, you can capture all 52 dicks. 52 dicks. Um, yes, I am going after the 52 dicks. <laughs> so, yeah, 52 dicks. Thank you, John Cooper. Now, I'm expecting autocorrect had to be a thing. And to be honest, if Dex is being autocorrected into dicks... Your phone might be used in dicks more than decks. And if that's the case, um, then I'm in the same boat there with you. We got some issues. Just kidding. I'm <laughs> just playing. Just playing. No, but that was nice. Um, <clears throat> yeah, that is my goal. Or, you know, that is the long term goal, I should say. Deliver mafia thugs to the missile truck. Holy shit. But that is the overall, I guess, long-term goal, is to capture all 52 uh, dicks, uh, 52 cards. Well, cards, you know what I'm talking about, people. They literally just disappeared. Uh, okay. Yeah, so that's a long-term goal. Will we do it? We will have to watch and find out. Um, hit into that. That's fine. No big deal. Um, but no. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you guys for the comments. It uh, means a lot. Actually, it means more than you think. So, I like just conversating, bullshitting. So, if you want to bullshit some more in the comment section, make sure to go in the comment section and we'll bullshit some more. Maybe we'll have some more autocorrect. Who knows? But if you have more tips, that would also be lovely as well. So, right now, we're on our way. We're doing this mafia thing. Uh, mafia mission. It looks like we're going to be 
coming up on the Jack of Clubs, where we finally get to do that. Uh, once we do get the Jack of Clubs, then we're kind of wide open on what we can do. We can actually go for, I believe, the Nine of Clubs and the Ten of Clubs, if I'm correct. And then uh, we can go for the big honcho. Holy shit. Uh, yeah, we can go for the big honcho, which is the big ace daddy. We're going to drive right past these guys. Since we are disguised. <clears throat> and we're going to actually, I guess, drop these guys off at this truck? Missile truck thing? Missile truck? Yeah, missile truck. I don't know if that does anything. Oh, shit. I don't know if we need to destroy it. What? Okay. Okay. I'm I'm guessing. Get the hell out. Just get the hell out. We're going to have to get out. I'm guessing we have to destroy it. Alright. Oh, there's a little bounty there. We can destroy North Korean vehicles. Anti-air rocket drop. Holy shite. That was a good stumble. I've never... I don't think I've been in one of these. Command vehicle. Bonus. Deliver missile truck to the Mafia garage. I beg your pardon? That's what you want me to do as a bonus? Is to deliver it? Okay. One at a time. Like, can we take down the guy and then I can fetch this later? <clears throat> okay, this thing has no brakes. No brakes. That was scary. Alright. So I think what we're going to do... Hopefully not get spotted right here. And then I think we might... Russian supply drop? No. We're going to actually put this into uh, our own... Oh, by the way. As you can see, we have... Uh, from, obviously, the lost vids. We have quite a bit of money. <laughs> we have a million dollars right now. So we can buy, essentially, whatever we want. Anti-air rocket. That's actually going to come in pretty handy. Uh, vehicles. What was our vehicle? Oh, yeah. North Korea. Um, oh, shit. No. We're going to go to the airstrike and do gunship support or cluster bomb. A horde of soldiers facing you down. How do I use this? Excellent for use against enemy personnel light vehicles. All right. We're not using that. Uh, point and shoot devastation count on Americans to deliver hail of bullets with pinpoint precision. No, we are not responsible for loss of gunship for anti-air. It's SAM missiles. Is there any anti-air down there? It doesn't look like it. I think we might... God damn it. We might be okay to do that. Surgical. We can do 51,000. We can do 76,000 for a gunship. Okay, it's laser. Okay, good. So, I think we're going to do that. We're going to laser in the middle target. And we're going to see how this actually goes. I th think we hold down our target so that they know where to hit. Oh, shit. Oh, that is anti-air right there, I think. Yeah, I think that is anti-air. Oh, they're dead anyways. Alright, so they got their guns dry. We're going to go ahead and finish off this last tank here. We got North Koreans. Oh, shit. Okay, so they... Okay, good. They're all dead. Now we can focus on... How do you melee? Oh, yeah. Excuse you. Hello? Okay, it's just the Russian. I thought it was like North Korean. But I think what we're going to do is just focus on this guy now. Now that we can, let's do that. This guy's actually pretty heavily armed. Um, a lot have, a lot more than the King of Spades and uh, Queen of Spades, actually. Pretty impressed. What do we got? RPGs? We already have a couple of those. Oh, God. Is he in the turret? Oh, no. No, I don't think he is. Not sure, though. I'm not going to take any chances in case I just dome him. And then there goes our perfect streak, right? Equip the frags, throw the frag. Alright. Oh my god! There's a lot of them! That train is pretty cool looking, I'm not gonna lie. It reminds me of like the World War. Those armored trains. Pretty cool. 
All right. Hong Do Hong Do Son Un Son Un Son Un. Sure. I'm gonna bash that right in front of him. Ooh. Take him down. He looks like just like the Jack and Queen. I think we'll do that. Anti air is out of the way, so we don't have to worry about that. Um, we got our extraction. Let's bust open another crate. See if we get any goodies. No goodies at all. Um, calling it in. Run over here. I think we're clear. And then we'll deliver. You know, thinking about it, I wonder if the mission completely ends when I put him in, and then I can't deliver the truck. Because if I can't, that's kind of dumb. Because then I would have to drive all the way back into town and drive all the way back. What's the point of that, right? Hopefully that's not the case. Hopefully I can drop him into the extraction and then I can drop the truck off. That's ideal. Oh, oh, careful. Very nice. So we got everything but the 9 and 10, I think. And 100,000? Jack's in the bag. In the bag. Hundred thousand dollars. Thank you very much for that. Very appreciated. New shop item. North Korean transport delivery. Okay, so that's basically that big truck. And that did take away the Huh. Interesting. Did not appreciate that one bit. Hmm. Our truck is getting shot at. Alright, well, <clears throat> that's that. <laughs> So now, with all that said, um, what we can do is we can... Because right now, our last mission is the Allies. And so what that Ally mission is going to do is going to take us to the Ace. And that's kind of going to be that. However, I want... There's a couple Look bounties. What we got here. Chinese fuel truck delivery. Well, there's our fuel truck <laughs> that the Russians wanted. <laughs> but... um. <clears throat> What we're gonna do is, I think we're gonna go on a little egg hunt, a little Easter egg hunt, and um, go try to find these other clubs, because I really want to take them out. So let's actually look into this right now. Okay, so Chil Hon Cho, if I uh, pronounce that wrong, you can go ahead and slap me. Cho was responsible for security within Division 39. As such, he is the closest thing the Division has to an intelligence director. While Division 39 operated uh, covertly from within President Kim's government, Cho was responsible for ensuring that neither Kim nor his closest advisors ever learned of Song's plans. Okay. Where can... Whoop, hello. Okay, there we go. Where, where can we find Mr. Cho? Da, da, da. Cho is the security chief. Yes, we know. Fly files. Da, don't make him. Don't expect much of a fight. You'll find him north of the DMZ. Hmm. Interesting. We'll find him north of the DMZ. So what? We'll find him um, north Pyong. Maybe right there. Hmm. Interesting. So what we'll do right now is actually we'll get out of this truck because we don't need to be in the big truck. We'll take a little bit of a faster vehicle here. And let's see where we are exactly on the map. We're going to head towards the allies. Yeah, we're going to head towards the allies. And um, we're actually going to take on one of our... We're going to take on Roland's Common, right? We're going to go see um, our... Oh, shit. That was a weird bug. We're actually going to go um, maybe take advantage of... Wait, there's a dirt road. I'm curious, George. We're going to actually take advantage of the helicopter that he provided our tip or free tip with. There has to be like a bounty or something over here. Yeah, there is. Hopefully it's like vehicle supplies. Look what we got. Nah, just a blueprint. Well, it's money, whatever. That's fine by me. <laughs> Alright. So we'll go ahead and make our way down, which we could technically order a Hummer and not be so and not be so dangerous as far as driving two allies. You know, quote, 
drive to allies with um, with North Korean vehicle. Smart idea, right? No. Turn left or oh god. Yeah. So um <clears throat> how are you guys doing? How is your month going? I think I already asked that. Maybe I already asked that. Who knows? I can't remember now with these past um past lost vids, you know what I mean? But um yeah. So I was watching another YouTuber and I was watching him do a let's play of mercenaries. And funny enough, um, I looked at some of the comments, and it was, uh, there was something I actually wanted an answer to that I, I don't, I, at this time, moment in time, I haven't gotten an answer for. And so I commented and asked, or someone commented and said, hey, are you playing Mercenaries on the Xbox One or Xbox One X? He simply replied, he's playing on the Xbox One. So my question was, is there, I'm actually going to go, um, to the helicopter that Roland showed us about. So if you don't know and didn't really understand what he was talking about, um, the HQ's right there. So you're gonna take left. Um, yeah, you're gonna take left, and the big bridge. That's called the big bridge. You go down, and then you go kind of like southwest until um, you hit like a smaller bridge, and then when you hit a smaller bridge, you just take that. But anyways. Um, yeah, I kind of asked if uh, I really should get in a different car. We're actually going to take that car right there. Oops. Yeah, oops is right. Oops is right. I asked in the comment section if um, if it, there was, like, a big difference. Like, is there a difference playing these games, uh, backwards compatible games, in a sense? Is there a big difference between graphical or however pixels or however they... Is that a bounty? Let me check. Yeah, it is. Sweet. Um, if there's a difference in, uh, you know, if it's better in a different, I don't know. You know what I mean. If the graphics are better, basically. Um, so I'm kind of waiting on that. So if you know, um, God, this is a tiny bridge. <laughs> if you do know, that would actually be kind of useful information because I really want to know. So the helicopters right here, this is the transport helicopter that Roland was talking about. Basically what you do is you get in and you hit no. You cancel that. Cancel the challenge because you don't want to do the pointless challenge really. And uh, we kind of just fly away. And we're actually going to use this helicopter. Should we use it right now? Yeah, we should. We're actually going to use it to find one of our um, either 9 or 10. And so we're going to look at 10 right now and just see what we've got here. Kill Kim. <laughs> Hell of a name. Um, da, da, da. You should be more than a match for him. He's somewhere southwest of the DMZ. So we have one that's north and somewhere southwest. So the closest thing right now is the southwest. So let's go southwest. Now if I'm guessing he might be somewhere. Maybe he's in the propaganda village. Or the farmland. Because the Haiju, that's how you pronounce it. Um, that's where the, I believe the queen of, spade, or queen of clubs were. So we're going to head that way. But yeah. So uh, that's that. I wanted to know. Alright, so we're not going the right way. Alright, so north is on our compass. So let's go southwest. So we got anti-air up here, if you can see that on the mini-map. Don't want to fuck with that. Uh, I've got more anti-air. Can't really maneuver very well with this... Uh, oh, oh, shit. Shit. Oh, got a little framey there. Got a little framey. Um, but yeah, we actually found the club. We actually just stumbled across it. Nice. This is the train. Okay, sweet. Ten of clubs. Nice. Alright, so this is going to be a little bit tricky, actually. I haven't used the transport helicopter yet in this playthrough. So, we're going to actually... Shit, 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 shit. Oh, yeah, I think we just got hit by... Yep, there's the AA. My lord. What is this? That's exotic looking. 
Okay, so helicopters are down. Allies are down. Ten of clubs is right in front of us. Take out his goons before we go after him right now. Because he is kind of a bad aim anyways. Bounty? Look bounty. What we got here. Health? Thank God, health. Alright, now let's go ahead. There's another bounty behind him, so that's kind of... He is, like, really in here. Take you down. And that will be the Ten of Clubs. So, Southwest, this was. I wonder where it was on the map, exactly. Nowhere near. Wow. Uh, where we were thinking. I, would you really even call that Southwest? No, I would call that South... Unless they were... <sighs> Unless they were talking about southwest of of the Allies base, but that's more southeast. I don't know. Who cares? What is this? Dragon-headed staff. All right, so let's pick him up. Let's uh, go ahead and come over here and... I don't think they know what's going on over there, so I think we might have a little bit of an advantage here. But who knows, if we, like, let me see if we can kick, can we, can we, like, crack down this and, like, kick it? Alright, that's not working. So I wonder if we can do this without our extraction getting blown up. Okay, not clear. Not clear. Not clear, I'm guessing, yeah. So let's enter this big bad boy. What is this? Anti-air. Okay, we don't need anti-air. So what we're going to do is we're going to blow that bitch up. Get out of here. We don't need you. We don't need you. We can use the RPG. Kind of feel like a waste, though, but we're going to do it. Okay. Okay. See if we can actually hit that one over there. Because that anti-air might interfere with our extraction also. Oh, we actually hit it. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. He's rolling. He's rolling. He's... I don't know where he's going. Well, I think that might have taken care of our problem now. Now, let's jump on this. Is this a missile gun? No, it's a machine gun. I guess we could jump onto it. Did I just throw a grenade? I am disappointed in myself. <laughs> oh my god. Um, let's see what we got here. Let's see if we can take some of these people out. I should just honestly rush them. Like, there's no point in me trying to snipe them back. I'll shoot a missile. Okay, that box just appeared. That's lovely. Civilians. Alright! I just got... I don't know how... <laughs> I don't know how I'm living right now, but my guy is a champ and just took an RPG directly to the face and everything's okay. Yeah, so, um, back in the day, um, I used to be a cheater, and I used to play this game with cheats, and so I never really got the full experience of mercenaries, because I was young, I was a kid, I was naive, <laughs> and, um, I thought it was like, you know, only, only cool kids played games with cheese. For instance, go figure like GTA, all right? GTA, everyone played like San Andreas. They play San Andreas with cheese. Who who the hell didn't, right? Um, and that kind of went for me when I played this. God damn, this clear zone. There we go. And that kind of went for me when I played with this game. I don't know if you know, you probably do. Um, you could actually probably do it nowadays. But, um, there's cheats to where you can have, like, infinite money. Um, you can have unlock everything, and then you can have god mode, and then basically you're unbeatable and the game's broken, right? <laughs> um, I did that a lot as a kid, and, uh, and frankly, with these extractions like this, I didn't care if, uh, the captain was captive or was dead or was alive. Um, I simply just went in and blew the shit out of him and just, in a way, ran through the game, right? So I don't remember much of a lot because it happened so fast, but, you know, I do have some fond memories here and there. So Young Kilkim has not been killed and has been captured. 
lovely. Hey, can I actually take your guys' No? Okay, that's fine. Yeah, so with that, um, if you put in cheats, let me know if you were that kid that put in cheats. Let me know in the comment section below. Did you use cheats? Did you use infinite money? Did you use all end locks? Or did you use god mode at any point? That guy looks like he's frozen over there. Are you okay? Sir. Sir? Okay, he's moving. We don't like you kind. We don't like your kind because your kind shoots RPGs at my face. Uh, pardon me? No, 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 no. Whoa, whoa, hello. Um. No, 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 no. Worst day of my life. Okay. Well, I guess that answers my question of what I'm going to do next. Um, I guess I have no choice but to call in a vehicle. Oh, there's the... Yeah, okay. Cool. Chinese fuel truck. That's cool. So we're going to call in the Hummer because, you know, why not? Yeah, so another thing about this game is that... Um... um hey. Well, I guess there isn't another thing about this game. The game is the game. Yeah, the game, you can, oh, that's pretty cool. Little cargo bob in the H3 there. You can basically get through this game quite fast, pretty fast at least, relatively fast. Um, it's not much of a grind. And um, you can play it pretty casual. Like you can actually hook this up, put it on your big screen, um, sit on the couch miles away from the screen and play this game. and not stress about it at all because it is pretty much an easy game and um you know it's, it's uh, did that helicopter spawn i think it did if it did i'm gonna hijack it instead of shoot the driver but yeah it's a casual game for sure um mercenaries 2 came out also i don't know if you guys enjoyed mercenaries 2 or whatnot if you guys did or did not, you guys should definitely let me know. Um, no, I don't want to do the challenge. Um, the majority, though, kind of didn't like Mercenaries 2. And that's that. <laughs> and mercenary, Mercenaries 3 just... Oh, shit. Whoa, that can't be good. Oh, my God. 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 No, 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 no. Go away, go away, go away, go away. Go away, bees. I hate you, bees. I hate you, bees. I hate you, bees. Thank you. Yeah, so not a lot of people enjoyed Mercenaries 2. For me, Mercenaries 2 was... It was a 50-50. Um, right now, we're actually heading north. We should be heading north, because I believe that's where our next... Where is he? Where is it? Deca 52. I think that's where our, our 9 club is. Cho is responsible. Yes, we know he's responsible for a lot of shit, but where is the guy's the guy that is responsible? Here we go. Um, dung, but f files don't make any. Okay, d don't expect much of a fight. You'll find him north of the DMZ. Okay, so when they mean DMZ, do they mean the Allied HQ? Because when I think of DMZ, I think of the entire map because what is it uh, demilitar demilitarization zone pronounce that why don't you but I think because that one was kind of misleading southwest it wasn't really southwest so I think I'm gonna actually go north of the allied HQ and uh, see what happens there but yeah uh, mercenaries too it was it was good it was all right um I didn't really enjoy the placement as far as where it was at. I mean, oh my god, Check look at that. That is amazing. We just found it right like that. I didn't enjoy uh, the place where it took place. There's some things I enjoyed about it. There's some things I didn't like about it. Um, but it was fun overall, I guess, in a way. Um, let me know what you guys think because if you guys are a big mercenaries fan and you guys enjoyed mercenaries 2 a lot or actually hated mercenaries 2 and wish there was a mercenaries 3 let me know 
I would like to know because I don't have a lot of friends that play or that played mercenaries back in the day so I, they don't I can't really relate to them and we can't really discuss it I mean they'll say that maybe they played mercenaries 2 but they never played mercenaries 1 and so it's a hard you know thing to different from but yeah let me know definitely I would be interested to know anyways we got the nine of clubs so that's wonderful we uh, stumbled across him we are kind of hello we are low on health though I just kind of realized that so we might actually call in one of our um, god damn it ah uh. Oh, these guys are just spawning right outside the hillside. How you doing? I hate this. I hate how precise it is. It's like, no, I don't want to go there. No, I don't want to go there. Right there. Good lord. Right there. All right. Okay. This game hates me just having a bad overall day with this game I mean not to the fact that I mean to the fact that my o operating software platform thing you know what I'm talking about not only did it not record my commentary which is freshening as all hell but now I just cannot get an extraction zone to save my life and it kind of slows down the gameplay because you're like, dude, what the hell is your deal? Just put the thing on the thing and then get the thing thing, right? Yeah, I wish it was that easy. All right. If these guys would stop just spawning out of there, that would be kind of nice. I kind of move some vehicles here. I know they probably can't. Yeah, they probably can't go on a slope, which we're going to have to figure out about this. I think we're just going to blow this bitch up. Yeah, miss it. That's fine. There we go. All right, so, well, I don't know. Maybe that will work. We'll see. Blow that up out of the way. Will that work? Yeah. Okay, cool. Roger, All we had to do. Going to be more simple. All right. Very nice. Very nice indeed. This is going to be a little bit of a longer episode because it's kind of like making up for the fact that, hey, you fucked up. <laughs> hey, you fucked up. So... Um, I think I... What the hell are you doing? No, 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 no. Get... No, 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 Hello. Hello. What the hell are you doing? What in the right fuck are you doing? You're gonna kill yourself. Excuse you. Ma'am? Ma'am? Hello? You hit the goddamn tree. And now you're fucking up. Oh, this is... This is... This is painful. This is painful. We're gonna just slide down this hill, I guess. <laughs> oh my god. You're kidding me. Well, this is awkward. Oh, oh my god. 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 This is a fucking train wreck. This is a train wreck! Oh my god. I am almost dead. You guys are a piece of shit at landing. Why don't you guys go play some flight simulator or something? God damn. Oh my good lord. That was the worst thing that has ever happened to me in this game. That was so painful. I can't explain. I really... Um, okay. Don't throw him off the goddamn uh, hill that right there was annoying that guy has an RPG not only did I sit here and try to get a, an extract going on but to come to find out that you didn't land where I wanted you to land and you killed yourself and cost me money oh now you're just pissing me off Oh, you are a slight devil. There. Roger, this, is Expo two. I am in the this should be good. Where are they coming from is the big question. Because if they come in from the same direction and hit the same tree, I'm going to be pissed. 
Okay, let's try this again, shall we? We are gonna need to get health soon before our allies kill us. Did wait? Is, wait, did is he not coming? What is going on? Oh my god! Support loss. What in the right mind? I was just talking about how Mercenaries One was a good game, better than Mercenaries Two, and now it wants to shit on me. Come on, get up here. You don't. You're pissing me off. Yeah, I know you see the smoke. This is the third time. Third helicopter that's had to do this. Jesus. Land the bitch. What? If it's on that side, I'm going to be pissed. Oh my god, it's on that side. <laughs> god damn it. This was the frus most frustrating captive I've had this entire Let's Play already. And that includes the lost vids. Alright. That's that. X-Ops is over. Done with that bullshit. Jesus. Alright. Yeah, good job. Whatever. God, I'm gonna kill this last guy up here. I'm gonna grab some... I'm gonna actually pay for some health. And buy some health. And in that case... That's gonna be that. That's ridiculous. Where's health? Yes, I want some health. God. Alright, let's see if we can get this down correctly. Are you kidding me? It's just a box. Okay. Yeah, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab some health. I think I'm gonna wrap up the episode here. Um, like I said, it's gonna be a little bit longer than the other one because I do I do deeply apologize for what has happened with the lost vids. It's very unfortunate and um, and everything. But like I said, you guys didn't miss much. You guys did not miss much at all. And and the big the big things really is the Jack, Queen, King, and Ace. Those are the big things. Um, yeah, you did miss Jack. Er, no, we did the Jack in this episode. You missed the Queen and the King. But um, we we did the Jack. And uh, we did the Nine. We did the Ten. And now we will do the Ace of Clubs in the next episode. Right? Alright, so like I said, very encouraging that... Um, you guys go ahead and comment in the section below. Tell me that I suck and tell me that I just ruined the entire Let's Play series because I did lose those vids. So be it. That's what it is. That's what I deserve. That's what I get. Um, but if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit that like button because it really does help out the video. Helps me out a lot. Uh, probably more than you think, actually. <laughs> uh, hit, hit the like button actually makes the video go into the YouTube algorithm to where other people can sit and watch and enjoy the Let's Play series as well if they're trying to find a Mercenaries Let's Play also. But till then, um, subscribe for more Mercenaries and I will see you guys in the next video. It's been a pleasure and honor like I said and I will see you guys very soon. Take care.